a lot of people want to know, Steve, how do I learn to be funny? And that's one of the most common questions I get asked by aspiring speakers. How do I learn to be funny? The thing is, I don't think you can learn to be funny. It's a skill that develops over time and not everybody can do it. So how important is humor? There's an old adage that says you don't need to be funny as a speaker unless you want to be paid. So humor is very important if you can use it. But if you don't have, if you're not a natural funny person, one of the worst things in the world is trying to watch somebody who's not funny and watch them try to be funny. That is excessively painful. So if you're just not a funny person, here's a couple of things that you can do to get by. And I know some people, I know some big name speakers who rely on these things. Go to Google and Google funny commercials, funny cartoons that are relevant to the content and pop those into your presentation every now and then. And people enjoy that. I don't do that. I don't really do that approach personally, but I understand why people use it. And it is a way to do it. You can also hire people to write jokes for you. I, again, I have not done that. I know people who have. I would say it works out maybe 50% of the time because being funny isn't just about saying the words. Being funny is about giving life to those words. And as professional speakers and as even as aspiring speakers, that's a good skill for us to develop is to give life to the words that we're trying to portray to the audience. So being funny is something that if you can develop it, it is a huge asset. If it's just not part of your skill set, then don't try and force it because it looks worse than not being funny at all. It's painful for most people. <laughs>